Sunday at 2 p.m., one of the world's most famous churches made headlines for horrible news. I was in a dance group in the chapel in church when I heard some gun shooting. Houston police say a female shooter in her early 30s opened fire inside Lakewood Church. Everybody was crazy, running. People were screaming and scattering. The shooter, dressed in a trench coat and backpack, according to police, brought a small child, just four to five years old, with her. Two off-duty law enforcement officers shot her dead quick. That child was hit in the crossfire and is in critical condition. This is a tragic day. Police Chief Troy Finner said a 56 or 57-year-old man was also shot in the leg or hip, but is stable. Before the shooter died, Finner said she announced she also had a bomb. No explosives were found, but she was also spraying some type of substance on the ground. A bizarre scene, investigators say they are working hard. Pastor Joel Osteen joined their news conference to offer a message of hope. We're going to stay strong. We're going to continue to, to move forward. And there are forces of evil, but the, the forces that are for us, the forces of God are stronger than that. The people who survived this will likely lean on their faith after fearing for death in their most sacred place. We hid about 10 adults in a closet. We were all praying. And all we had to defend ourselves is a box cutter and some wood to block the doors. We uh, come to church every Sunday and everything is good, happy until today. And as horrifying as today was, Chief Finner said without those brave off-duty officers. She had a long gun and it could have been a lot worse. Obviously, there are a lot of important questions left still tonight, like who was this woman, what was her motive, and what was her relationship to that child she brought with her. We will be following closely as investigators release more details, including the updated conditions of that child and adult man who were shot.